Today we are at Wallace Simpson's Whirly Gig Park. And when the wind is really going, this thing is really, really something to behold. See all kinds of people out here checking it out. This one's starting to go. He's got like milk bottles attached to the outer ring here. Look at that. It's just, I believe this town's called Goldsboro. It's just like right in the middle of this town. Vala Simpson's Whirly Gig Park. Isn't that awesome? We'll kind of work our way around it. I really wish this one was going. What I like is the reason it's not going is because they're all built in different directions. So depending on which way the wind is blowing. See, that one's really rocking. That's how you get to see each one move is based on which direction the wind's going. And look, it's I mean it's literally like a like a town square with people stopping by to check it out. Everybody parked up along this way is here for it. slowly going see I wish that one were going look at that that would be very cool to see North Carolina state line now look at that big jobber <laughs> things intense and it looks like the actual whole piece rotates around the pole based on the wind as well here is the proper entrance to the park not entrance but I guess the welcome sign I was too enthralled with what I was seeing I was like my luck if I don't start filming right now the wind will stop blowing Look at him go! Racing towards us. This is not a magic trick. I am not doing this. Shows you the amazing power of the wind though, doesn't it? That's a guy up there. A worker, it looks like a park ranger almost. A bicycle. I love all the colors too. Lots of color. On oh, that one, the farthest one down there, it's like a horse and carriage, like a mule train. It's not really moving either, unfortunately, but. I guess it's slightly moving the propellers each piece here has a little propeller and those are going and that is slowly making the big one go again if you're ever like looking for a way to teach kids about 
physics, this would be a great way to do it. And that all important favorite word everyone loves, it's free. Pretty much open as long as the sun's up. First I thought that was a headless animal up there and then I noticed that it did have a head. Hey, you never know. You're probably thinking this is like the first time you've never told us anything about the person that created it. Well, I just figured they have a plaque up here about Vala Simpson. I figured we'd just let their words speak for it today. Well, I couldn't find the plaque. I thought there was a plaque, but this is about the market that's like across the street. Vala Simpson was actually a local artist who, in his spare time, he would make these sculptures, these kinetic sculptures out on his family farm in uh, Wilson, just outside of town. And he, when he retired, he did it full throttle until about six months before he died. And eventually they, I believe they moved them all into town here. Made it Vala Simpson's Whirly Gig Park. I'm sure glad they did. This is great. Well, my friends, we're going to call it a day. That's all it was today. Just a walk around Vala Simpson's whirly gig wonderland i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope it was a nice distraction from your day have a good night and goodbye mm -hmm.